Mr. Pistone. Ah, Bane, how are you, Bane? Oh, you bad. Fantastic, how about yourself? Bane, you know how I told you I wanted to be part of the shadows and I know I have to ascend still, but I have a very, very beautiful offer for you that might be coming your way shortly that I think is you are going to love every minute of it, Bane. Please do, do share. What is this offer you want to give me? Why don't I come up there? Meet me on top of the pit and we'll talk. Yeah, I'll be on my way there shortly. All right, goodbye, Bane. Goodbye. I gotta go take a ride somewhere. I'll be right back. Chad, you gotta understand the backstory of Bane. Bane was a lifer that got out. I, hey, Bane, I'm here. Bane. B -b -b Bane, I'm here. No, 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 Ah, Bane! Hey, 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 Mr. Vinny. How you doing, buddy? So listen, there's a lot of crazy yeah. shit going on right now. Oh, I'm well aware. And we're trying to get rid of a few people for preparations for tonight. And Ooh. I was thinking, and I said, this would be perfect for somebody that has spent his life in prison up until he got <laughs> out. Um, yeah. How would you feel if maybe a couple of your old people that you had to listen to all the time got thrown here? Are you talking about corrections officers? Yes. Have you been, uh, beefing with some of them? We have to get rid of them for a certain something tonight. Ooh. I'll lay it out on the line for you. Rami is having a bail hearing tonight, and if it goes south, we need to limit numbers with them. Oh, this is very interesting. Now, who I else? actually do like this. Now, who else could I think of that literally was tortured by these motherfuckers that they thought they had power over somebody? I was like, well, hmm. That's Bane. Now, what if these people were Bane's prisoners? After them being your... You were their prisoners. Yeah, see, I see. I, this idea is very flattering to me because I'll let, let you wait on a little bit of our story of my own recently the DOC have been stepping a bit too far out of line shit talking me and my people and i haven't really taken a liking to it too much but you know that the DOC what's the point in wasting my time and resources on them they are nothing but ants under my shoe but if i can have a little fun with them in quite an easy way such as this then mm. well i might have to take you up on that offer but uh -huh. I have a few uh, worries about that. All right. Few little worries. Uh, one, if uh, wood were to get out that I run this place like a facility, mm -hmm. I will start getting looked into by the police and detectives mm. and whatnot. And obviously, that's, it's that's a giant gaping hole in the ground. Yeah. So it's quite easy to just take a gander down there. Mm -hmm. Trying to minimize the amount of heat I get from the government. But, uh, that brings me to number two. What happens if, uh, you know, like, uh, the little blips, the little trackers on the GPS with the cops, they see them thrown down here, the cops just come here and they see mm. that I'm having fun with them. It would be a nightmare. That is true. I didn't think this thoroughly. But, I just thought about fuck it, because yes, listen, yes, I'm not yes. going to lie to you. The person that's on this case is probably the dumbest motherfucker somebody hired. Okay? And I don't know if you know a guy named like Crackhead Craig. But he's the dumbest oh. fuck. 
And he doesn't know what to do with these motherfuckers. So I said, let me go talk to somebody quickly and I'll get back to you. But if they, cause I didn't, he didn't think through about getting their trackers off of them or anything like that. So I don't want to be, I don't want it to be a problem to you. That's the thing. Mm -hmm. No, 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 no. I'm glad you were at least talking to me about this beforehand. Yeah. However, I will raise a compromise, right? You can use this place. Mm -hmm. However, me and my shadows won't be able to make an appearance. Mm. So as, as long as we are not tied to this location, they just see this as a, a mysterious hole that caved in on itself. No one mm. knows a damn thing about this place and what its purpose is. See, so the problem the I'm DLC having is that them in here. I don't want them, like, seeing the inside and seeing, like, the cells and everything and them, like, knowing it's something more if DOC makes it out, then... Oh, trust me. The police are, have already been down there before. Okay. Yeah, to, to be honest, uh, I think they don't give a shit. Hmm. All right. So if you want to bring them, because I've already had a DOC try to climb out before. Okay. The deputy warden, or actually, <laughs> should I say the warden himself now, because he is a warden. He was trapped down here and he almost climbed his way out, but he failed. So we put him in the water and flushed him out into the ocean. Hmm. But, uh, yeah, I have no problem with the DOC seeing the bottom of the pit. It's uh -oh. more, of a, it, yeah, because it's more of a thing. So, because you know how, like, like on transports, like if you're from the courthouse to the prison, there's like 40 fucking cops, then you have like eight to ten yes, DOC. Seven, eight to ten D yes. So we're trying to yes, eliminate yes, yes, as yes. much as we fucking possibly can. Oh, I would love for you to dump them in here. That would be a beauty for for me to behold, because there's no way they are getting out of here if they don't climb out or if they don't take the sewer pipes. All right, beautiful. So what I'm going to do, I'll, I'll tell this fucking idiot that uh, somebody hired. You won't be around just to get him fucking tossed in there then. Mm -hmm. Just hold him in and pray that they survive the fall because if they don't survive the fall and they hit their head and mm. they might get flushed out via the water. That is true. That is true. And I won't be around to get you guys to escort them down properly because, you know, the obvious gripe I brought up. Mm. Now, it would be a different story if you eliminated their, uh, the other uh, tracking Yeah, problem. that probably won't be able to happen. That's the problem. Yeah. No worries. Listen, if you want to bring them here, toss them in before your big, uh, you know, your big break, mm -hmm. then by all means, go right ahead. It'll be, uh, beautiful. All right. I'll get working on it. Uh, I'll let you know. I'll I, I'll text you. Uh, come get pizza if it's being done. Yes, come get pizza. I, I like that. A good good code name. Yes, code code words are the way to go, Bane. So what you're saying? Uh, what Rami's got a Bailey hearing, and um, do you plan on seeing if it goes well, or do you plan so on So Rami, right now, if you go to the docket on the government website, he is being yes. charged with Bass's murder. Who? Dear. So you know how intense this is, and you know the the fact that will they actually give him bail for the commissioner of s fucking Los Santos's murder? Oh, absolutely! I see where you guys' is, uh, concern lies. Yeah, because we did a meth run yesterday that led into a huge shootout, and they when they caught Rami, Rami was totally blindsided by it because we all got gunned down. And then Rami mm. was sitting in an interrogation room for three hours, and then sent up for a twenty-four hour hold turned into a hut charge, and now he has a bail hearing. Interesting, interesting, mm -hmm. interesting. Very interesting. Well, I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think if I, if I have any information for you to be able to do this properly, but I don't think I do. I, I just know vague DOC protocols from my time in prison observing them. So if there's any questions you have, I might be able to answer. 
Uh, well, he's doing his job to get them. He's he's telling me he's sitting in their trunks when they do uh, cigarette runs and pizza runs, and <laughs> he's, that's what yeah. he's doing right now. And like, then he's gonna start just scooping them up and then try. I said, "What are you gonna do with them?" He's like, "I don't know." And I said, "What do you mean you don't know, motherfucker? He can't." Dump him in here. I'm like, "You can't have him around." So I said, "Let me go talk yeah. to somebody and we'll figure it out." Yeah, I think uh, I think this could definitely work. You just have to guarantee that they don't get uh, washed out right, right away. You... Make sure they do well in the pit for a good hefty amount of time. All right, sounds good. All right, I'll call him and let him know yes. to start uh, plopping, and you get the hell out of here. And but like I said, if it, it, it goes down and he completes it, I'll message you uh, well, the code word. Be, uh, there's a good yeah, chance I might be able to sleepy sleepy in oh. one of the back staff rooms down there. All right, but beautiful. Even if I'm not around, I'm yeah, still fine with you to. guys utilizing uh, this field. Hanging out on the block, man, you know? Because all the cops know that this this is just a natural formation. Yeah, it's just an yeah, ancient yeah, formation yeah. from many even generate. Yeah. Yeah. And this is from, like, this is an historic site oh, that they uncovered, and they and all those oh, cells. Uh, it's it's all historic. Yeah, Jill said she has an A-plus mm -hmm. right now. If anything, they're becoming enlightened by getting put in such a religious place. Yes, and it's it's part of history. That's all you could go with. It's like when they found like the tombs in in Egypt and the pyramids and all that, you know. This was un yes, this was uncovered yes, and yes. found, you know. So hey, they they'll never know. Beautiful. It's gonna truly be a beautiful sight to behold. Yes, and I figured to come right to you because I knew it was DOC and you were fucking stuck in that hellhole. And now to have them stuck in your fucking hellhole will be amazing. Yes. Listen, I also wanted to throw something your way, and it's entirely optional. I just want to get the the word out there uh mm, right now we don't uh, really charge people for any services because i mm -hmm. mean i get paid in entertainment so i really could care less about money however the pit is uh starting to encounter some financial problems so if you ever wish to make a generous donation to our business here please feel free if not that's fine that won't be a problem at all let me ask you a question do you need anything I might need firearms. How about if I could uh, work something out with you that I could give you a steady line whenever you need? Steady line of uh, weapons. Whatever you need. Uh, if you need cameras. Radios. Yes, cameras, two radios, all that Weapons, shit. Weapons. We hate Handcuffs. Shit. Grapple guns. Yes, yes. Grapple guns, yes. What if I could have a connect for you with that, that I could have somebody deliver to you whenever you need, and, I, and I'll make sure it's at cost? I like that. But... Yeah, I can do that. You know, maybe, um... Maybe, uh, I, I become more than, uh, just have to ascend here. I, you know, I could come... I could become part of, like, the little shadows, in a sense. Yes, Mr. K was deemed a member, uh, well, a kind of a special member of the shadows, deemed the Shadow Dragon. I'm sure you learned in one way, shape, or form of such a thing. But Mr. K is the Shadow Dragon now mm. in this very pit. And I believe if our relationship blossoms with this whole deal, you'll be able to get a title of your own. Can I be the Malden Shadow? Molding shadow. Yeah. Mmm. I like that name. <laughs> I'll keep that name aside just for you, Mr. Bestowed. And if our relationship blossoms into a beautiful flower, I will bestow upon you that name. How about you do this? Next time you need something, or if you need something now, you let me know. And I'll show you how quick of a turnaround I can have for you. Hmm. Yes, I'll keep that at the back of my head. I like that. This is going to be beautiful. I can already tell. And these are how relationships are born, Bane. Yes, they are. All right, buddy. I will text you as soon as uh, something goes down. I'll let you know. Of course, and I will call you if I need anything. Yeah, you let me know ASAP. I got you, all right? Appreciate that. All right, Mr. Bane. Media. You have a great day. Good luck on your plans. I'm excited to see it come to fruition. Yes, yes, Bane, yes.